Alright boys, we are trying this again, and this time, I've got heavy artillery. I actually, I, um... I defeated all the guys and still have the fuel cans up here. So, we are, we're gonna mess these guys up. This is, it's, it's, it's over. Where are they at? You. I can take you. Shit. Well, the first one missed, but that's why we have multiple. The one thing I have noticed is they don't like going through this door, which is a good, good thing for us. Alright, not so tough now, are you, Mr. Super Powerful Guy? See ya! Let's go, boys. Alright, holy cow. That could have been easier. But uh, we got it done, and that's all that matters. That's everybody, right? I think that's everybody. Okay. Whew! Boys, we had to fight for that one. Oh, that's not everybody. Still quite a few more. We're going to go back. Just because we have an extra explosive, why not use it? You know what I mean? Still have one more. I was hoarding these things. See you down there. It's only gonna get one of them. Didn't even get one. I damaged him though. All it took was a kick to the face after that. Get a kick to the face and then they get up and they they get punched. All right. Well, boys, I don't know why they were hiding and came out afterwards, but I guess it makes it easier. I didn't have to fight them on top of the uh, what's it called? be able to open that up? I don't think so. Any baddies? Not seen any. Well, that was not helpful at all. What's <laughs> the point of that thing? We need some water. That's what we need. Oop. There's water right here. Duh. Almost walked right. We need water. Sees a water station. Nearly walks right by it. Alright. That's good stuff. 30% bonus water from the essence ability. That's... Awesome. Up in here, we're gonna have to uh, to turn this thing to be able to turn that off. Now we're through. I feel like if we could take that down somehow, that'd be pretty useful, but I don't know. All right. We do have to be on the lookout for more uh, war criers. I'm going to make sure we take those guys out before they see us. Some scrap back here. I feel like we're... 
a little bit lazy on the scrap in this one. We only have four out of 12. I don't know how, how much farther we have to go into the base, but I feel like we're pretty far, you know what I mean? There's another big area ahead, though. I guess we haven't even gotten to, like, the main guy yet. We still have quite a ways. Down into the dungeon, boys. Here we go. Double sniper rounds. Surprise, there are no enemies down here. New enemy, Feral. Ooh, Ferals are bred like dogs and kept in cages, all born through the ranks of the war pups. Check for defects. These are swarming enemies that dash in with quick and vicious attacks. The trick is to dispose of a Feral before it has a chance to attack. A shotgun blast comes in handy. Shit. Ooh. The first one had a triangle, a triangle evade, and then the second one had a an R1. So that messed me up. Shit. Their attacks aren't very strong, but they're just quick as hell, dude. Gollum ass. Checking for loot, boys. Got ourselves an explosive. More scrap. Seven out of 12, I guess it's going a little bit better. Uh-oh, new enemy, Pig and Sticker. Yeah, this is gonna Whoa! Take some time. Pig, the leader of Tyrant's Lash, is unkempt, loud, slimy, and vile smelling. Sticker is a moniker he earned later from the drawn out torturing of the innocents using a long and heavy knife which he stabs into non-lethal but painful areas of the body like a perverse butcher. His crew lives in fear of him for he has been known to torture his own men for pleasure. Holy cow. Well, we have another water machine here. Looks like it's 100% full too, so we're gonna be able to... gonna be able to drink up to full health. Fill up the camp team the rest of the way. And then we're gonna we're gonna face pig and sticker boys. This is gonna be interesting. Here we go. Whew. What's up, Mother Chugga? I see a bunch of ferals. I see a war crier. Let's 
gonna take out the war crier, I guess. Oh. These lands will echo with your screams for ages. <laughs> you come into my house now. Holy cow. So he's surrounded by a group of these stupid... So I think if we take down that right there, it's going to allow us to get over here, and that might let us get up top and get something good. So that's the plan for now. Not available. Okay, so I guess we got to do that after we kill him. So we're just dodge, go in for a few punches, dodge. Oh shit. Alright, so you seriously, you need to dodge the second. Wait till he charges you. When he charges you and does that, that's when he becomes vulnerable. Otherwise, he's not vulnerable. We're gonna go to six every time. Six hits and then dodge again. It's better to play it safe than to, uh, to be sorry. You know what a good one would be? If we come over here and then punch him into the flame. Seem to hurt him that much. Let's try it again. We didn't get to hit him very well. That's good stuff right there. That's that's good stratego trap. Good strategy. You'd think he'd learn. I'm worried about eventually going in the fire on accident, you know what I mean? Like lunging to hit him and, and lunging into the fire. Actually, I think I'm the one that's going to kill him, bud. Alright. Should take one more, one more combo, maybe two. Depends how this one goes. the harder they fall baby good stuff top dog camp tyrants lash is gone killed the top dog allies have now infiltrated the camp they're gonna provide regular deliveries of scrap sounds good to me let's get this loot 95 scrap
killed the top dog. Congrats, boys. That was solid. How do you get a bait on that thing in the silo? We took down like one and a half levels on that. That was pretty good. Any more scrap up here that we can grab? Ammo or anything? Nope. Ooh. Can we zip line on this? What the hell is in that silo? I don't know. Alright, anyway, we're gonna head back to the, uh, the Magnum Opus. We're gonna head on our way. Our next actual objective is to, uh, to go to Gastown and dance with death. So that sounds pretty intimidating. I'll see you guys there. And, uh, should be good.